Jalen, uh, it seemed like down the stretch there in the final six minutes or so of the fourth quarter, Miami really took control and dictated the pace. How, how did that happen? Uh, I think they, they outplayed us. They outtoughed us tonight. And they, they found a way to make plays down the stretch, and we did it. It seems like the late game execution has been a recurring issue for you guys. What, what's happening in the last few minutes that's, that's leading to the turnovers, the offensive fouls, and, and giving up the offensive rebounds? Uh, I just think that, you know, one, we just got to stay poised. I think we get sped up at times. Um, and two, we just play basketball. In those moments, we got to, you know, come alive. And it seems like we, we let the game slip away from us when we are in those situations. Jalen, uh, over here, the zone, you guys were able to kind of break through, get in, move the ball, and then crunch time. You guys never really got the ball inside of it, kind of just kept swinging it around. And every time they closed out, you guys just wouldn't quite be able to get past them. You know that's what Miami's going to do. You face them for several years now in the same round. You, when you guys know what to expect coming, you know you have the talent to do it. How come you don't think you're able to get past it? They do a good job of mixing up when they go zone and when they go man. They, they keep you on your toes with the people they got on their floor. And, you know, we just haven't figured it out in terms of how to exploit it every single time down the floor. Uh, we got to recognize um, certain situations and um, credit to them defensively. They've been able to, you know, hide some of their guys defensively in order to, you know, um, slow us down on offense. And you guys miss a bunch of open looks at the end that any one of those going down could have changed it. You, this has happened a few times throughout this playoff run where you've just missed open shots. And at what point do you feel like, especially when the season gets closer to being on the line of you guys just need to try to create a look that works for you rather than taking the shot that comes to you? Yeah, I mean, I thought we had some great looks. Um, me personally, I thought I had some great looks um, down the line that didn't go in. Um, can't stop with our, aggress our aggressiveness. You know, we're going into a hostile environment. And we got to do what needs to be done. Um, you know, so we got to come ready to play. When it comes to the fourth quarter execution, do you feel that you guys are you know, as connected as you need to be and that the trust is there in one another? Or do you feel at times um, guys are looking to make their own plays in terms of uh, and not maybe uh, trusting the structure? Uh, no, I think you know, we, we pretty much run the sets. You know, we just got to be more forceful. With the ball at the same time, we, we can't get too apprehensive. We got to still be aggressive and take what the defense gives us, but, you know, step in and knock shots down with confidence. You know, I think we start to look, you know, in, in situations and we should just go. And uh, I think that's it. Did, did Grant Williams make a mistake poking the bear with Jimmy Butler? Next question. Uh, in those moments when he starts to come alive, how does your team need to respond and, and kind of fight back against that? Um, defensively, just continue to fight. You know, this team is going to fight from beginning to end. Hey, that's what they do. And, you know, those little, those little moments of lapses, cost us, giving up threes, not being into the body, offensive rebounds, you know, that stuff has an effect on the game. And we got to be better. I got to be better. Jalen, for you, um, individually, from a shooting standpoint, had a tough night. What did, were they doing anything to you just to take you out of your flow? If you feel like for early on in the game, what did you kind of, how do you assess yourself there? I think they just, you know, mixing up when they go man, when it goes on. Um, you know, either trying to guard me with guys that, you know, are obvious guys that you would attack, but they're using the rest of the guys to kind of help and pinch down, making it uh, tough to get to the basket. And, and things like that, and also, you know, mixing up their reads in the zone, um, being alert, and we'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. Jalen, right is it is it mental? I mean, going back to the bubble, they just seem to, to to be the tougher team down the stretch, games one and two. They just seem to they know they can catch you. Jimmy knows he can get to his spots. How do you, is it mental, and how do you guys try to recapture that where you have the edge? Just got to come out and fight, play basketball. I think uh, both of these two games, you know, they've been able to come out on top, but who's to say we can't come out on top in the next two games? Uh, we just got to come ready to play basketball. Can't lose our confidence. It's the first of four. Um, should make for a better story. How do you guys not lose, keep your confidence when 
that's gonna, probably going to be an issue over the next 48 hours. Oh, uh, yeah, no choice. You had no choice. Shake it off. Obviously, we let um, two games here on our home court down, let our, our fan base down, let, you know, everybody down. But, you know, we got opportunities still in front of us. So you look forward to it and you get up and you play basketball. Jalen, right in front of you. We saw it in the third quarter in game one and then in the last six or so minutes tonight. What does this team have to do to, when you get challenged, when you get a punch to the face, to respond and, you know, have an answer when the lights get brightest and the stage grows? Uh, you know, be mature, be poised in those moments. It's a veteran team. Like, they are good at exposing your weaknesses. They're good at feeding off of indecision. You know, continue to be aggressive and just continue to be yourself, you know. Um, it is a, it's a challenge mentally. It's a challenge physically. You're disciplined. Um, we just got to be, we got to overcome. We got to find a way to win one, and then we go from there. Why no mask tonight? Uh, my face is feeling a lot better, so I just went without the mask today. That's something that can fluctuate game to game. Um, Are you done with it? I might be done, um, but we'll see. Thank you, Jalen.